Grimal. You may know me, you may not know me. It's cool. Either way, you're going to get to know me because I'm part of the Effort of AM cast this year. Obviously, I'm a senior here at Effort of High School. I like to do theater and acting. I also like video games, so I'm not a complete geek. Well, actually, yeah, I am a complete geek. <coughs> I also like to read books. I like to listen to music. I actually have a record player. I like my record collection a lot. It's pretty cool. I have stuff. Whatever. <sighs> anyway, I do shows at the Effort of Performing Arts Center, and I'm currently doing one called The Man Who Came to Dinner. And I'm actually working with Mrs. Olinger for that show. Mrs. Olinger. Hi. She is music teacher Hi. at middle school. Yes. And I'm doing a show with her. Yes. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, because I'm in it. I'm Maya, and I'm also in the show with Ethan. So yeah. I'm also doing Newsies. I'll hopefully be doing the school shows this year as well. So you're going to see me around school a lot. If you just see me in the hall or in a class, don't be afraid to say hi. I'm not going to bite you. I'm not a rabid animal that needs to be caged or anything. <coughs> okay, maybe. So this is my sister. She's a junior. And uh, she didn't want me to record her, so I kind of have to use this photo. But anyway. I have a brother, he's not here right now, but that's where you usually find him. Or it cheats. So, um, it's a little bit about me. I don't know if I'm in focus or not. However, I'm just gonna keep doing this. So you can enjoy me being blurred in and out. Okay, bye. <laughs> Good morning, Ephraim. My name is. <laughs> Good morning, Ephraim. My name is Drew. My name is Kevin. And today is Wednesday, October second. Please rise for a moment of silence and pledge the flag. Today, representative from D Sales University will be here at 1.15. Tomorrow, representative from Goshen College will be here at 9 o'clock. Any students interested in meeting with the representative in the CRC, please sign up in Schoology. It's that time of year again. Be sure to check the daily themes for Spirit Week. Giving you guys a quick run through, today is Taurus Week, Thursday is Color Wars, 12th grade is white, 11th grade is red, 10th grade is blue, 9th grade is black, and Friday is purple and gold. College-bound juniors and seniors, come to Financial Aid Night on Thursday, October 10th at 6.30 p.m. in the Ephrata High School Auditorium. A representative from the Pennsylvania Higher Education Assistance Agency will be here to present information on all things financial aid. Sign up for the ASVAB in the counseling office today. If you are in 10th, 11th, or 12th grade and need some help making career decisions, then consider taking ASVAB. The ASVAB is designed to help you learn more about yourself and the world of, of work. Explore occupational skills and line of your interest and skills, and develop a strategy to realize your career goals. The free assessment is offered at the EHS on Friday, November 1st. Stop in the counseling office to sign up today. There is absolutely no military commitment. Exciting news! We've been able to extend the deadline to turn in permission forms for the Kutztown University field trip until this Thursday. Stop by the counseling office and grab a form today. This is going to be an awesome trip. You don't want to miss it. Calling all clubs and sports. If you are interested in speaking at the fall prep, pep rally to represent your club or sport in front of the school on Friday, October 4th, be sure to reach out to Chandler Huby or Jocelyn Umana for few, further information no later than today, Wednesday, October 2nd. Attention future leaders. You have the opportunity to be selected to attend the Hobie Youth State Leadership Seminar this coming May. Two 10th grade students will be selected based on their response to the following. Many leaders are determined and committed to a cause. Write about something you are passionate about and explain how you could lead others to care about your case. Please submit your brief essay to the counseling office by Friday, October 4th. 
Blood drive signups continue during lunches. Be sure to sign up in order to donate and pick up the required forms before October 11th. Now over to Dilly Willie with the news. Not so pale. You're on it. In today's news, it has been announced that the U.S. will now crack down harder on imported goods that have been procured or manufactured under forced labor. These new measures come to light during the serious trade war incited by the president with China and could block a myriad of goods from being imported from Malaysia, Brazil, the Eastern Congo, and Zimbabwe. These goods include gold, diamonds, and clothing, among other things. On this day in history, 1959, the now legendary television show The Twilight Zone premieres on CBS. This groundbreaking show would introduce fantasy, science fiction, and thriller tropes to Americans and set precedents for many future productions in these genres. Now over to the juniors with the lunch. Well, good morning, Alfreda. I'm here with the amazing Mike and Ms. Brim Hall. Good morning. Good morning. Today, they're going to come at you with the lunch all by themselves. Well, what you guys are looking forward to, it's going to be awesome. You're going to have chicken nuggets with a whole grain roll with margarine. And a cheese steak, a uh, French roll. Or you could have a turkey burger with cheese, whole grain roll. Turkey BLT, a uh, flatbread. Taco salad. French fries. Red pepper strips plus dip. Fresh broccoli and dip. And of course, fresh fruit or a slushie. That amazing slushie. Love all. Time for sports. Yesterday in sports, the cross country teams faced off at Lebanon. The boys went 0 and 3, while the girls went 3 and 0. Boys soccer lost to Mannheim Central with 60 seconds remaining in overtime. The girls won 2 and 1. Field hockey lost 3 and 0 at Warwick. Today, there are no events. And now back to the main desk. Anyone interested in being involved with the dance team here at the high school? Signups are underway in the athletic office. Anyone who is interested in joining a book club or our first meeting will be on Thursday, October 3rd, after school in the library. This is different than the Reading Olympics. You don't need to bring anything to the meeting. See you there. The new chapter of the Science National Honor Society is currently accepting applications from sophomores, juniors, and seniors. See Mr. Kellogg in room 107 or Mr. Ewing in room 111 for an application and more information. Applications are due Monday, October 7th. Once again, it's that time of year. We are pleased to announce that this year's EHS Homecoming Dance will be held on October 5th from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. Join us for a night under the stars and pre-order tickets during lunches for $10. You're also welcome to buy tickets at the door for the price of $10. See you then. Before you all leave, we'd like to wish a very happy birthday to Miss Ludwig. She's the big 5-0. Happy, happy birthday! birthday! Happy birthday! Oh. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah! Woo! Epic. <laughs> Oh, uh, that was...